just a day before uh, i was up, i was going for the vespa interview i had watched a few of your videos so in total there are four months which is like very rare in the industry yeah. from what i'd seen oh yeah that was one of the major reasons that i went for vespa Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Priya Jain and today we have with us Zeel Tucker. She is doing an industrial training from Benson Corporation and she'll be helping us to answer all your questions regarding industrial training at Wilson Corporation. Before that, I want to emphasize on the fact Wilson Corporation has just released their vacancy for CA industrial training. So make sure you watch this video till the end to crack the interview. So let's get started. Hi Zeel, how are you? Hi Priya, I'm good. How are you? Yeah, I'm doing good. So let's start the video from a quick intro of yours. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, I'm Zeel Thakkar. Uh, I've I gave my CA foundation in November 19 and cleared in first attempt. Then I gave my intern, cleared it, and started an started my articleship at a small sized firm, Aitchison Company in Ghatkopar, Mumbai. Uh, I it was since it was a small size firm there was there were no departments I got to work on audits stat audits tax audits uh, GST TDS ROC related work and all of that uh, I wanted a corporate exposure before becoming a professional so I think industrial training is a great way to get right. that so I decided to go for it okay right, that's right so how did you then apply for your role in this company. Actually, uh, right now it's this is like the golden period for people looking for job opportunities because LinkedIn is such a good source for everything. Uh, I started uh, cold messaging people and uh, sending emails, sending my CVs to people. The one mistake that I made was I started very late. Like I wanted to join from Jan, uh. and I started uh, sending out my resumes in December. So and the w- one more thing that I would like to tell everybody is that uh, please inform your principal well in advance because that has co- consequences if you don't. Yeah. Oh uh, yeah. So I had to convince the Lord because I informed him just a month prior to joining. Yeah. So I had to convince him a lot. So uh, at least inform your principal well in advance at least three months before you plan to join. Uh, then I. Uh, I since I had very little time left before I wanted to join I could not get uh, that many interview experiences I just gave in, I just sent out my resumes uh, to very few companies and I got calls from most of them and I appeared for interviews in four companies out of which I later joined Wellspun Corp Okay can you just give us a brief about how many rounds of interview were there Yeah so uh, there was one telephonic round where it was basically about my background and uh, what I was what department I was working in it was a very uh, short and brief conversation and uh, then there was just one face to face round which was like an offline interview which was in the Westpan office okay uh, it was a mix of technical round and uh, a little bit about you know what i uh, where i come from and all of that zeel can you please elaborate on interview questions at different companies yeah so i give interviews at four companies westpan corp plum goodness nature's basket and mars which is a pet nutrition company uh, all the interviews start with the same question tell me about yourself or a little bit about your resume uh mostly 50 to 60% of uh, an industrial training interview consists of your articleship questions uh and your experience and the work that you've done there uh so it was mostly about that uh in wellspun specifically i uh, since the department is accounts and direct direct tax i was asked about uh tax audit the tax audits that i've done uh the other stat audits that i've done um a little bit about the form, direct tax related forms which are 15c 15cb the usual forms and uh, a little the role also includes accounts a uh, preparation of accounts so i was asked if i had a uh, prior consolidation experience or not uh, so just go through the jd once before going to your interview because uh, they will ask about that yeah so that's about wellspun Okay so like how did you prepare for the interview have you referred anything else Yeah so at Plum Goodness uh, there was one instance where I mentioned that uh, I had seen their annual report and I was quite impressed by the uh, state uh, by the fast growing startup and how they were recovering their losses so they were very interested about that and uh, 
like there were two three questions which i was not able to answer earlier in my interview uh, but i think this was something that uh, got me selected there so uh, if you can just go through their annual report once uh, also at um, mars i was asked if there was any specific instance in my statutory audit experience where i faced a difficulty and i solved it with, by myself or with the help of my manager so that was something that they usually ask about uh, your any specific experiences during your work, course of work so if you have any any anything interesting that you had done during your articleship or some problem that you faced and solved it by yourself then you can mention it in your interviews and they'll find it interesting okay and so what's your current work profile at wealth and corporation what do you do on a day to day basis Yeah, so my department is accounts and direct tax. So we have to file um, the fifteen C A fifteen C B forms. Uh, we so we also have to prepare tax audit reports, which uh, have not started yet. But I'll get that experience soon. Um, also, there are a lot of subsidiaries, so we have to prepare their monthly financials. Uh, these are small companies, so uh, we are able to do that by ourselves. uh also uh i joined in a very golden period i feel at wealth fund because there was a major merger going on and i got to do a lot of work related to that so yeah there's something new i feel that in articleship there's a cycle of work that mm. uh, goes yeah. on year on year basis but in industry you'll get to learn something new every day that's what i've experienced in the past 3 months okay that's that's very really great i mean a work on mergers and acquisition is something which generally is not available for a trainee i think generally yeah exactly that was not something i uh, i thought i'd get to do but uh, when i joined yeah i got a lot of it so that's great okay all right so next will be how much stipend is there for this role uh so at wells but it's around 22 to 25 uh and like uh, out of the leave there's uh, the two months of leave is uh, paid okay so yeah so how many leaves are there in total for the study so in total there are four months which is like very rare in the industry yeah. from what i'd seen oh yeah that was one of the major reasons that i went for wells one because uh, i feel if you if you get enough time and uh, then there are lot of chances that you clear with good marks and that is the most important thing right now right yeah correct that this is actually a very different day yeah yeah and also um, we get 15 days of advance idd oh. uh, apart from that four months yeah so this is actually so out of week <laughs> yeah <laughs> okay all right so like yeah. do they ask for a defining your attempt or something no no in fact they motivate us to give it our first attempt and clear it out and uh, so in, at last can you just give some tips or uh, your anything with from your interview experience or your work experience on like the skills people need to work to get this role yeah so basically there are two things that i specifically want to give advice on or yeah. we start early like i did that mistake because i started in december and i wanted to join from jan so i still get calls from the companies uh, like till date i get calls uh, about the resumes that i sent 3 months ago so if you start early you have you'll get a lot of options basically correct yeah, right. i uh, like i got to, i got a very uh, less time to decide and i had to convince my principal also that's also one thing that yeah. always uh, inform your principal well in advance yeah. or else you'll have to face consequences or they may not even allow you i was on good terms with my principal so he finally allowed me to go for industrial training but i have friends who who had principals who did not allow them to go to so that's that uh also i feel uh, the one major reason why you should everybody should go for industrial training is that you constantly work with the people who have reached on the positions where you aspire to be in a few years so that's like a daily dose of motivation that you get so it keeps you uh, motivated every day to study harder so that's one more reason to go for industrial training also as uh, even before becoming professional chartered accountants we get to uh, we get that taste of the corporate culture that's also an add on yeah i absolutely agree with okay yeah. then i think uh, all this information will be very helpful for the students who are looking for industrial training and as you mentioned that there's a recent vacancy also 
so yeah. i'll uh, i think this will be very helpful for the people and uh, thank you so much for azeed for taking out your time and uh, be here to share some of the insights thank you for having me priya this is like a full circle moment because just a day before uh, i was up, i was going for the wellspan interview i had watched a few of your videos yeah. so it's like today i'm here sharing my experience so it feels like a full circle moment yeah and i'm really like it's very much a kind of a validation thing for me as well it was someone yeah. who had watched my videos and maybe that helped them and they are now sharing their yeah. experience this is something which i i was looking for actually yeah and thank you for mentioning this thing because i was not aware <laughs> <laughs> no no keep the good work up you're doing great yeah thank you so much thanks so much please okay